Welcome to Kit's Learning Corner. Today we're going to learn about recycling. I'm sure you've seen different colored bins close to your house. Those are for recycling, and the colors tell us what kind of recycling goes in each. Food scraps and other waste that's organic, which means it comes from living things, should go into the general dumpster. The trash in the recycling bins are taken to a recycling plant. There, the material is melted down or turned into paper. Afterward, this melted material is used to make new items we can use. The best thing about this process is that it can be done over and over. Come on, kids, let's recycle. Let's save the environment together. <laughs> Today is beach day. Don't forget the sunscreen, kids. What? Uh-oh. What's Dr. Spooky doing here? He's released some robot insects. And they're putting chips into the people at the beach's heads. What's your plan this time? He has a baton. Oh, and he can control everyone who has a chip with it. He's so evil. He's making everyone get the beach dirty. No, kids, don't litter. Oh my gosh, you're so bad, Dr. Spooky. No, 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 we have to do something. What a disaster. Dr. Spooky is destroying the environment. Someone stop him. Yay, there's the Super Zoo team. Aha! If we can remove the chips from the people, they will stop obeying Dr. Spooky's orders to litter to the transformation capsules! Springboard to reach Dr. Spooky. What a good idea! Go get him, Kangoo. We have to get the baton away from him. What? Why do you want to draw a portrait of Dr. Spooky, Kangoo? How vain! Oh, now I get it. You're trying to distract him. Ha-ha! <laughs> Monkey swapped the baton with a banana. See you later, Dr. Spooky. Let's go, Super Zoo team. We have to remove the chips from the people's heads before Dr. Spooky catches up to you. He 
has control. And she's going to make the minions help clean up the beach. But where does each kind of trash go? Kangoo has the answer. Glass goes in the green bin, paper in the blue one, and plastic in the yellow one. It's time to recycle. Let's go, kids. We need to clean the beach. And Dr. Spooky can't do anything to stop it. You'll think twice next time. Everyone works together and leaves the beach spotless. Remember to do it too, kids, when you go enjoy a day by the sea. The environment will be eternally grateful. One more thing. Ha-ha! Bye-bye, Dr. Spooky. It feels so great to take care of our planet. and don't forget to recycle the trash. are happily soaking up the sun and some beautiful butterflies land on top of them. What? Wait a second. Why is everything turning gray all of a sudden? Where is all this smoke coming from? Ah! Look up, butterfly! Everything is polluted! There are our friends from the Super Zoo team! Aha! Just as I suspected, this is the work of the evil Dr. Spooky. There's that villain. Let's go to the laboratory. We have to find a solution. Let's see what your supercomputer says. Hmm. 
Hmm, I think I know where you're going with this. We have to plug the ship's exhaust pipe. Aha, and that way the cloud of smoke will disappear. What a great plan. To the transformation capsules. Wait a minute, you have to be protected. With this bubble, the pollution can't hurt you. Now we're ready, Super Zoo Team! Aha, there's Dr. Spooky's ship. And he even has popcorn to watch his horrible show. Get him! Oh no, Dr. Spooky is releasing his minions. What's the plan now, Caddy? <laughs> Throw the pieces of wood at the minions. What a good idea! Yes, we did it! <laughs> Don't forget the plan. We have to plug the exhaust pipe with one of the pieces of wood. <laughs> Perfect! Monkey throws Caddy towards Dr. Spooky's ship. And Caddy lands after doing a perfect flip just above the exhaust pipe. Done! Haha, <laughs> 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 Dr. Spooky, the tables have turned against you. Bye-bye, <laughs> you evil man. But there's still one thing left to do. Let's go, Granny. Do your magic. <laughs> Granny's magic bubbles get rid of the pollution. How delightful. And all of nature goes back to being full of life, like it should be. <laughs> Blow a giant bubble, monkey. See you next time, Dr. Spooky. What a great day to surf. Groovy Ryder and Monkey are really enjoying themselves. Was that a can? A jug? A bottle? Uh-oh. Is everyone okay? Groovy? Ryder. Woo, 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 woo. What about Monkey? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. There he is. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What happened? Uh -huh. Why is the ocean full of plastic? A trash island has formed. And it's huge! How is that possible? It seems like Monkey has an idea. Maybe we can take the trash out of the ocean on the surfboard, all the way to the shore. Oops, that didn't work like we'd hoped. The board is sinking. And it sank right next to a strange pipe. Trash just keeps coming out of it. Where does this pipe go?
What a strange ship. <laughs> Dr. Spooky, how did we not notice before? You're the one putting trash in the ocean. <laughs> Kids, we have to... Wait a minute. What's that floating in the water? It's a fish trapped in a six-pack ring. But Groovy freed it. To the water, Ryder. Our new friend wants to show you something. You're not going to believe where the pipe leads. Exactly! It's Dr. Spooky's ship! What's your idea? Groovy turned himself into a giant vacuum! And he sucked up the whole trash island! But there's still something left to do. Dr. Spooky deserves to be punished. Monkey picks up a giant rock. And Groovy spits all the trash back into Dr. Spooky's ship. Dr. Spooky got a taste of his own medicine. Fantastic, kids. Dr. Spooky is going to have a hard time cleaning his ship. See you on the next adventure. Dr. Spooky is having a picnic. Yuck, he's gonna eat a greasy hamburger. Oops, guess not. How about that milkshake? Nope, not that either. Will he be able to eat the ice cream? Haha, <laughs> in your dreams. Wow, Dr. Spooky doesn't like nature at all. And nature doesn't like Dr. Spooky at all either. What's this? Why is he summoning his robot? Wait a minute, Dr. Spooky is uprooting all the trees in the forest with his robot. Yes, Granny, just as you can see, Dr. Spooky's up to his shenanigans again. Let's go, Super Zoo Team. We have to stop him. Kids, show us how on your computer. Aha! Caddy and Monkey need to press that button to control the robot. To the transformation capsules! Watch out! No! What? Oh, wait a second! Great! Monkey has stopped the trees! Now we're going to protect the environment! Nice aim, Caddy! Whoa. 
See you later, Dr. Spooky. Great job, Caddy. You're the best. Now what, Dr. Spooky? There's the button. Don't let him get away. Ha-ha! <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> Come on, Caddy. It's time to bring the forest back to life. We have to replant. Get up, Mr. Robot. We have to fix what Dr. Spooky messed up. Tree by tree, the forest goes back to being what it was, and no evil human will damage it again. Lovingly, everything is put back into place, and the Super Zoo team wins again! Haha! <laughs> <laughs> Nature is precious! That's why we have to take care of it! <laughs> Welcome to Kit's Learning Corner! Today we're going to learn about deforestation. The disappearance of plants is called deforestation. The trees are the shield that keeps pollution from reaching the atmosphere. Unfortunately, the levels of pollution keep rising and there are less and less trees. If there are no trees to keep the clouds of pollution in check, the sunbeams can't bounce back into space and are trapped on Earth. This is why the temperature is going up uncontrollably. Pollution makes us sick. Many living creatures also lose their homes when trees disappear. But it's not too late. How can we end deforestation? Planting trees and taking care of those that already exist. Picking up all of our trash to keep the trees from getting sick. Learning to love nature and showing all of our friends to do the same. Let's save the environment together!